Welcome to my channel. This is Bea Lenny. Thank you for watching this video. Today I wanted to to show my face so you can see so I can talk to you so I can tell you my thinking what I think about all these last videos that I've been posting. Now the videos that I'm gonna be posting are gonna be completely different videos like I mentioned before. Probably a lot of people, a lot of people is following me because of the Bath and Body Works videos that I normally post. But I think that now is something more important, something different that we need to use to let people know what's going on in this world, to let people know about God. So this video that I'm making, this is about telling you what I'm doing, what I'm trying to do, what I'm, how I'm feeling. Probably a lot of people will not agree with, you know, what, I, what I'm thinking. And it's okay, but I'm gonna tell you how I'm feeling and what, the way that I'm feeling that I need to be, what I need to be doing. Because we are living the last days, these days. I'm a person that grew up with uh, my, my parents. I grew up with my aunt, my uncle, but I grew up with them and they were pastors. They tried to push me a lot to be like, you know, a, a real Christian, go to church all the time, pray all the time. And I think this is my experience. This is my experience. I'm only talking about me. What happened to me was that because they uh, tried to push me a lot to, to do that, so I kind of I kinda went the other way, another side. I didn't follow, you know, what they were trying to teach me and I regret it so much. I regret it so much that I wish that I listened at that time because I, because I didn't follow what they told me, what they tried to teach me. I didn't learn about the Bible, about God. I regret it because now that I don't have my, my mommy, as I call it, my mom, that I grew up with her, now I had to be looking and learning myself about the truth. And I know the truth I can find that in the Bible because I believe a hundred percent that the Bible is God's word. I know if I go to the Bible, that's the truth. I believe everything that is in the Bible. Uh, I know some people will say, oh, but the Bible, I mean, wrote the Bible, how do you know it's true? I believe a hundred percent, this is God's word. I know a preacher, I know a pastor, I know someone who's been years and years going to the church and knows a lot about God and wanted to push it to go and go to church, no. I'm learning like some of you that I start learning little by little, but I'm, my, I, I'm, I'm going with the Bible say. So I read the Bible if I have something, a question, I go to the Bible, the Bible, the Bible, that's how you're gonna learn. I start going to church, I pray, I'm going to my knees, I pray to God. Because I believe in God, if we don't have God in, in our hearts, He's coming soon. I believe in that, He's coming soon, He's gonna, come and get us, whoever is not ready, I know it's not gonna go with him. And it's not like I'm judging some, someone, no. It's in the Bible that we need to follow what he says. We need to do what he says. If no, it's not like just to believe there is one God, no. God, the real God, we need to, that's why we need to learn, we need to read the Bible so we can learn who's the real God. I believe in God, I believe in Jesus. And I know we need to 
do the right thing to go with him. A lot of these things that are happening is in the in the revelations, in the revelations book in the from the Bible. You will find all that information right there. That's how I know that we live in the last days. That's how I know. And I pray to God to give enough time to some people that are not believing in Him. I pray to God to give the opportunity to some people to put their life together so they can start believing in Him. Because if they don't change their mind, they will be lost, they will stay, they will not go with Him. So please, 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 please read the Bible, find a good church. Pray to God. Ask God to forgive you. Also in the Bible says that we cannot be mad at our brothers. When I say our brothers, it's not like family, family member, no. Like your friend, people who you know, maybe some people you don't talk to them anymore. Ask them to forgive you because we cannot be like that. If God comes, you will not go with him because of that. Because God wants us to get along with everyone. Don't hold the, the bad, bad things in your heart. Don't be mad at anyone. Because God doesn't like that. If God forgives us, why we will not forgive someone else? Why? I know this is this is completely different of the videos that I was doing before. Sorry if you don't like it. I would really appreciate it if you at least listen a little bit, like to go to church, do the right thing, please, please do it. We don't have too much time. We don't have too much time. You see all those airways, California has some airways. There are like uh, in the news, uh, they were showing that, like they are in the earthquake mode, mode where they it's very 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 bad. Everything that is going on, not only in California, a lot of places. We need to be careful. We need to follow God rules. That's all I can tell you. I wish you could understand me. I know my English is not perfect. Is I'm trying myself to, under, to to give you the word for you to understand what I'm trying to say. This is my believing. I believe that you should do that too. I hope you listen. I hope this help you a little bit. But we need to have God in our our lives and teach our kids to read the Bible since they were are little teach them because when they grew up it's hard and it's, it's so difficult so only God can change their feelings the way to think only God and I always pray for everyone that's I think that's the only thing I can do pray and pray and pray for everyone to have the opportunity to save their lives and go with God when he comes and gets so I really appreciate it if you're still watching this video. I really appreciate it, your time. And I'm gonna be praying for everyone. I hope something that I say help you and follow, do the right thing, read the Bible. That's the most important thing. Believe in God, ask to God to forgive you because he's coming soon, he's coming soon. God bless you. I was reading the Bible and I was, I like to to read the Bible every day. Uh, I was reading Revelations too. You can, if you have a chance, read um, read chapter two. It's from one to 20. Read it and I, I love, I love to read the Bible. Cause I learn, I learn a lot. If you don't have a Bible, just go online. You can find the chapters there. But I will leave. Uh, I will. I will leave the the this 
this part of the Bible on, on the video so you can read it from that if you want okay so I see you in the next one and God bless you God bless you God bless everyone I'm gonna be praying for everyone God bless you and thank you so much for watching the video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed if you think this will help anyone share the video please and give a like God bless you Thank you for your time. See you next time. Bye now. Revelations 2, 1 to You can pause the video so you can read it if you don't have a Bible, if you don't want to go online to look it up. If you wanna read it from here, pause the video. But I recommend you to read it. 